Hippos are recognized as Africa's most dangerous animals and kill more humans than any other animal in the bush, but it doesn't mean other animals do not attack them, especially hippo calves. If you're curious and you want to see how it all goes down, keep watching because we're getting started. Number 45. In our first video, a lioness managed to grab a baby hippo that seemed to have been abandoned by its mother only to find out that the mother was not too far away, and when mom came charging to rescue her calf, the big cat scampered off. The hippo seemed to be moving slowly after the attack, but was still alive. It was difficult to tell if it had incurred any serious injuries as mom made sure the lions were kept at bay. Number 44. A male lion spots a lone hippo calf in the bush and decides to hop on the hippo's back. The small hippo is easily flipped onto its back by the powerful lion. The hippo is so afraid and screams out his pain, but the lion, hungry, is only concerned about one thing, eating the hippo. The lion can be seen slowly sinking his teeth into the hippo's body and carving him open while it's still alive. When another lion arrives, the only good news for the hippo is that this ordeal will end sooner than later. Number 43. While on a game drive in Africa, a tourist saw a lioness rush in to snatch a baby hippo from its mother. The mother was not going to let it go and rushed after the big cat to emerge a little later with the calf unharmed. No one knew what happened to the lioness, but it's safe to assume that it fled as soon as it saw the mother charging to save her baby. Number 42. Hippos are Africa's most dangerous animals, killing more humans than any other animal. But lions, when they work together, can take down an adult hippo. In this video, we could see some lions killing and eating a hippo. Number 41. Scarface, the dominant male of the Marsh Pride in the Maasai Mara, is enjoying a kill he just made overnight. It is a young hippo that did not make it back into the Mara River that day and became vulnerable to such attacks, paying with his life. Number 40. A hippo calf was quickly turned into a happy hippo meal by this lion, as the feline can be seen pulling the young hippo through the dirt. The feline can be seen enjoying its kill and it looks finger licking good. Number 39. When a leopard tries to sneak up on a hippo calf from behind, he doesn't realize that just a few feet away from the calf is his mom, and when she gets wind of this, she confronts the big cat and warns him to take a hike. The leopard tells the hippo he's not into hiking, but he's willing to learn. Number 38. When mom spots a hungry leopard stalking her calf in the middle of the night, she quickly runs at the big cat, chasing it away, but the leopard is tenacious and tries to figure out another way of grabbing the calf until mom and her little boy enter a waterhole to calm things down. Number 37. Shortly after being born, a mother hippo tries to lead her tiny newborn calf away from a lurking leopard on the edge of a waterhole. The male leopard chances his luck and sticks very close to the hippo until a moment presents itself. He launches an attack as the mother looks away. Thankfully, the mother is quick to react and chases the opportunistic leopard away. Number 36. A leopard uses all its strength to easily pull a hippo calf out of the water. I get the impression that the calf was already dead when the big cat spotted it, so it was an easy picking for the feline. Number 35. When crocodiles snatched and killed a hippo calf as the lions in the area looked on, the hippo mom, obviously upset, let out a cry for help. One of the less experienced lionesses seemed to want to jump into the water, but it would have been a fatal mistake to do so, because she would have been the next victim of the hungry crocodiles. I mentioned earlier that crocodiles were not afraid of any animals that may encounter in the wild, and they're not. But one animal that may make them doubt themselves is the adult hippo, hence the reason why the hippos we see being killed in these videos are usually calves. Number 34. This gigantic crocodile tries swallowing a hippo calf whole, but the animal seems stuck inside the crocodile's throat. No kidding, I mean, it's a calf, but it's still a hippo. What a difference of size between these two crocodiles. Number 33. During a morning game drive, a young hippo was taken by a crocodile in the Mara River. The baby could not follow its mother across a small stream, and as soon as the crocodile spotted the small hippo, he grabbed the animal and pulled a few death rolls to kill it. Number 32. In most circumstances, oxpeckers provide a valuable service to many animals, especially when they feed on fleas, ticks, and blood-sucking flies while the mammal receives free skin and parasite control. However, for other animals such as the hippo in this video, the oxpecker can cause problems by swallowing too much blood from an untreated wound, causing it to open. Number 31. 
This old hippo bull has seen better days. Wildlife enthusiasts watched him as he slowly paced uneasily down the riverbank and into the water. His battle scars attracted a flock of oxpeckers as they fed on the rotting flesh of his wounds. Number 30. Oxpeckers provide a critical service to hippos by keeping ticks and dead skin off their skin. They have also been known to keep host wounds open to feed on the flesh. Number 28. Hippos are extremely territorial, and if one male tries to invade the territory of another, there will be tension and eventually conflict. Hippos will not back down in the face of any challenge. Their large teeth are known to deliver a nasty bite when they open their mouths and attempt to chomp their opponent. Their teeth clash and the clamor is audible. One of the hippos surrenders and walks away. Number 27. Hippo fights are loud and spectacular. The river's constant change throws territories up in the air. Bull hippos find new pools in the flood, only to find other hippos ready to challenge them. Most of these fights are about noise and display, making a spectacular splash, staking that claim. Here, some victories are hollow, because these highly contested pools will ultimately ghost away anyway. Number 26. These two males take their battle from the water to the sandy desert, where one of the males becomes exhausted and abandons the fight and tries to run away, the other hippo doesn't let up and chases him back into the water where the chase ends. Number 25. If you think this hippo is dead, think again. It's still alive, but just barely, and that's why the hyenas are enjoying this food fest without any resistance from the massive animal. It's sad to see such a scene, but you can't blame the hyenas for eating food that's free and served on a silver platter. Number 24. In our thumbnail, we could see two hyenas chasing and biting a hippo's butt as the massive animal tries to escape. The hippo already has some deep lacerations on his back and has probably been weakened, hence the reason he is trying to run away. Number 23. A young hippo calf is being eaten alive by three hyenas in this video as they bite and tear into the young calf's skin. If mom or other help doesn't arrive soon, this hippo calf is doomed to suffer and die at the mouths of the scavengers. Apparently, the hippo calf, for some reason, was abandoned by his mother. Number 22. The way this hyena grabs a hippo calf by the mouth and pulls on it is merciless. Another, calmer hyena arrives and watches the ordeal the hippo calf is subjugated to and doesn't seem to care if it gets a piece of the pie. Number 21. In this video, hyenas tenaciously pursued a baby hippo in a standoff that lasted several hours. Wildlife enthusiasts were kept on the edge of their seats as the hyenas tried to attack the hippo, who only had a small body of water keeping it safe from their ferocious snapping jaws. Number 20. Only the most daring of Africa's predators will take on a fully grown hippo. With 50 centimeter teeth and thick tire-like skin, these large herbivores are notoriously cantankerous and one of the continent's most dangerous creatures. These facts do not deter these hyenas from trying to take the animal down, but considering the hippo is in pretty good shape, the hyenas will need to call for reinforcements if they hope to be successful. Number 19. An angry hippo is attempting to find some peace and quiet in this watering hole, but guess who shows up to disrupt the fun? A pack of wild dogs, of course, always on the lookout for an opportunity. The wild dogs don't really do much but crack the hippo's chops. Number 18. A tourist was on a game drive when a water buck was chased into a water hole by a pack of hungry wild dogs. The resident hippo did not like the pack of wild dogs around his water hole and decided to try and chase them away. The wild dogs harass the massive hippo, even though they wouldn't gain anything from the encounter other than some entertainment. Because this was such a large and strong hippo, the wild dogs would take an enormous risk trying to take it down, which was unlikely. So how did the dogs behave? They concluded that they'd wasted enough of their time and the hippo's time as well, and decided to call it a day. Number 17. This hippo opens its mouth wide as if to warn the buffalo of an impending attack, Yet the buffalo does not budge. With its mouth extended, the hippo charges the buffalo, attempting to crush it as it drives it into the water. Besides being pushed around, the buffalo doesn't do much as the hippo continues to chase it. Number 16. A goose would be the last thing you'd expect could scare a few hippos, but that's exactly what happens in this video when a few young hippos spot one at the edge of the water. The bird just stands there, but it's enough to spook the young hippos. Number 15. 
This elephant in must chases these hippos away, but a small hippo calf remains in the area, dangerously close to the elephant. The elephant is perplexed as the baby hippo moves around but does not leave. Finally, the baby hippo jumps into the water and swims away. Number 14. Hippos are territorial and scary, but it doesn't bother the elephants in the following clips one bit as they teach the hippos to back off and go back into their holes. Elephants will not be intimidated, even by mighty hippos. Number 13. A lone hippo messes around with a few elephants at a water hole when he taunts them by entering what looks like their water hole. Of course, the water hole doesn't belong to them, but they think it does. Surprisingly enough, the elephants don't bother with the hippo. Number 12. An elephant storms into a water hole filled with hippos, but the territorial hippos disperse to allow the much larger elephant rite of passage. The elephant isn't even that big, but the hippos don't argue. Number 11. The lion in this video has all the trouble in the world trying to slice through a thick hippo carcass. The animal must have been dead for a while, and it only made the carcass more difficult to eat. The skin of an adult hippo tends to be about 6 centimeters or 2 inches thick, and this is thicker than the skin of other large megafauna such as elephants, which is about 2.5 centimeters thick, or rhinos about 2 to 5 centimeters thick. So imagine how tough it must have been for this lion to cut through this dead hippo's skin. Number 10. Another brawl between two angry hippos can be seen in this video. The people filming were very close to the action, and their guide told them they could be eaten by the hippos if they dared enter the water during the battle. No kidding. It doesn't take a hippo specialist to know that. Number 9. These two bulls were engaged in a full-out battle for over two hours. Earlier that morning, a bull was walking down into the pan and into the other bull's territory, so a struggle for the territory ensued, and it lasted until one of the bulls conceded victory to the other. Number 8. Even though the native bull is larger, the outsider is in a precarious position. When five tons of hippos collide, their bulk, biting size, and brute might are all put to the test. The outsider admits he has been defeated. He must venture into the unknown as droughts tighten their hold. Hippos cannot survive in the wild for long without water because their skin is extremely sensitive to direct sunlight, which is why they secrete a red oily substance once thought to be blood that acts as a sunscreen and antibiotic. Number 7. In the wild, male hippos will fight for mating rights and territory, but guess what? It looks like they don't have to be in the wild to argue. These two hippos are in an enclosure at the zoo, and it seems like they're not agreeing on something. Could it be about the latest sexy female that arrived? Your guess is as good as mine, and even though hippos are dangerous and these hippos got into a scuffle at a zoo, usually in a zoo setting, the animals are used to humans, so they tend to be less aggressive. Wild hippos are very dangerous, since they spend time with one another without being fed, bathed, and touched by humans. Zoo officials know not to startle them or handle them badly, or else the hippos could harm them. Most zoos have lions, tigers, elephants, bears, and other dangerous animals, and they've all been conditioned to accept the presence of humans. That doesn't mean they won't attack. If they feel irritated, threatened, or just wild at heart, they will let all the humans around know it. Number 6. A male hippo can be seen attacking a baby hippo in a water hole, and it doesn't look like mom or any other hippo is there to help the young defenseless calf. Male hippos often kill young hippo calves to force their moms to go into estrus so they can reproduce as quickly as possible. Dominant males do not sit on the throne for long, so they know they must hurry to create as many babies as possible. Nevertheless, the hippo is a social animal that lives in groups of 10 to 30 individuals. They've even been spotted in much larger groups of up to 200. There are several adult females and adult males in the herd, but one dominant male. He has the right to mate with any adult female in his herd, but he will occasionally allow subordinate males in and around his territory to mate. The dominant male marks his territory by flinging his dung as far as he can with his fan-shaped tail. Number 5. This video was shot in Zambia's Luangwa Valley. The former reigning bull was most likely defeated and chased off by the hippo bull. He discovered a calf that wasn't his within the pod. His gene dominance instructed him to mate with as many hippo cows as possible. For the next two years, the hippo cow with a newborn will be infertile. To get her in estrus, he had to murder the calf 
so the suckling would stop and the cow's biological system would inform her she had lost the kid and she would begin ovulating soon after. The new reigning bull has no idea how long he will be able to sit on his hard-earned throne of power, so he must get to the point soon from a genetic standpoint. There is no time to waste or to watch calves grow up that are not his. Number 4. Hippos are not an easy target, even for lions, but these hyenas are astute enough to find ways to attack hippos, as evidenced in this video when they pursue a young hippo onto the road in front of many wildlife enthusiasts, waiting to see the outcome. The hyenas are not bothered one bit by all the spectators because their only focus is to eat. Number 3. You just never know what you're going to see at a waterhole. When wildlife enthusiasts arrived at this waterhole in Huangay National Park, it appeared empty. However, they'd learned that patience generally pays off. And it did. This playful young hippo, after the plastic water pipe doesn't respond, finds a live playmate, a crocodile. However, this croc is not necessarily happy about it. Watch what happens and who comes to the rescue. No blood and gore, just some laughs at the interactions between these two, which is rather strange. Number 2. These wild dogs harass this massive hippo in this video. It's not as if the dogs will gain anything from this encounter other than some entertainment. Because this is such a large and strong hippo, the wild dogs would take an enormous risk trying to take it down, which is unlikely. So, how do the dogs behave? They conclude that they've wasted enough of their time and this hippo's time as well and decide to call it a day. Number 1. When a pack of wild dogs tried following an impala in a waterhole owned by a huge and ferocious hippo, the massive beast attacked and killed the impala, throwing it into the air right in front of the hungry dogs that were helpless watching their meal being thrown away. The hippo is the world's most lethal large land mammal. Each year, these semi-aquatic giants kill an estimated 500 people in Africa. Hippos are highly aggressive and well-equipped to deal significant damage to anything that enters their territory. Wild dogs are much faster than hippos, even though hippos are fast for their size, hence the reason wild dogs take risks when they are around hippos. We have seen hippos in all sorts of battles, but my favorite has to be the last video when the hippo became so frustrated with the wild dogs barking at the impala that he took control of the situation and decided to get rid of the problem. I'm sure he would have killed a few wild dogs had he been able to catch any. Which one was your favorite? And why don't you let us know in the comments below? And well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be a part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.